This is Caillou Ninja News, or CNN for short, with your host, Caillou Ninja. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Caillou Ninja News, or CNN for short. And don't forget, I am your host, Caillou Ninja, which you may know because that's part of the name. CNN stands for Caillou Ninja News. So, okay, in the news, Governor Walmart announced that in person, the graduations can be held starting on July 6th. They have to be outdoors and have a maximum of 150 people, including gradu- graduations. Okay, do that again. <laughs> <laughs> take God knows how many. Take a thousand. <laughs> no, take a million. Take a million. <laughs> and then we got, oh, hold on. Wait, hey, okay, okay. Sorry, guys, we gotta interrupt this podcast for a very special report from Olivia Investigates. Okay, take that clip. Okay, well, I'm gonna talk about racing. It's not really investigating. Okay, okay, tell us. Okay, Danbury residents have gathered at the Danbury Library to demand de- justice at the end of racing. Thousands showed sh- support in a peaceful protest. I'm really glad my mom drove by for us to see. (laughs) We were all created equal and we should all stand up for against anyone or any system that tries to make us think otherwise. Back to you, Kai. Thanks, Olivia. We should all do what we can to end racism. Now to our next segment, can you ask a question? I don't know. Okay. Last interview on Caillou asked a question, we met Frankie. He, he is an awesome guy. He, he used his money to buy food for our first responders. Take a look, people. He is amazing. So, Frankie, I heard that you are a woodsman. Yes, I am. So, I got some questions for you. Who inspired you to do woodworking? Uh, my grandfather. Um, okay. Okay. So, question number two: How did you raise money to buy lunch for our first responders? Your um, boss. I raised money, um, and I sold hearts, um, and bunnies and trees, and that money I took to buy food for the first responders. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Now, question number three: Tell me more about those hearts of hope. Okay, um, so here it is. It's both sides. It's so real. It's like chocolate. <laughs> so. Okay, so question number four. Can I order one? Yes, you can. Blue, twinkly stars. Okay. Blue bow tie. It has hope and love on, okay. the, on the back and front. Okay? Okay. Thank you. And now the personal questions. Question number one. Dog my kid or Captain Underpants kid? <laughs> yes. I am. Um, That's a choice Under- question. Um, I am Captain Underpants. I, yes! I'm Captain Underpants kid too. Okay, so. How's all of school? Hard, easy, or okay? It's good. How about you? Uh, mine's great. Yeah. I did so fast. Okay, now the West one. The most important question of all. Okay. Who are you wearing? Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Frankie, do you want to send a message a message to kids all over the world? Sure. So, um, all kids should be kind and uh, like they should like help people and like, donate and uh, just be kind. Okay, you heard that, kids. Thanks, Frankly, for the interview. And keep up the good work, okay? I love it. Just take, check out my hair. It's so smooth, right? And guess what? Barber shops are open. Yeah! Gee, you are the best. Yeah! I love you. You're the, you're the best. 
You're the best barber shop in the entire universe. If you want to skin beautiful hair, at Blue Hills Barber Shop. If you want to have good hair like me, it's so smooth. It's so smooth. This is the end of the show, everybody. And don't forget to subscribe to youtube.com slash c slash slash Ninja. Bye-bye now and see you in the next week's episode.